Hello everyone and welcome back to Star Stable Online and we are back with Autumn Promise, our brand new Welsh pony. Oh, she's so beautiful and she has her brand new friend, Tiger Lily, the cat who we have had from Yarlaheem for quite a while now. And I think Tiger Lily and Autumn Promise are actually getting along very, very well, especially because Autumn Promise has these gorgeous, gorgeous leaves. She has a love of leaves and Tiger Lily and Autumn Promise will hopefully be able to go and enjoy the beautiful hollowed woods pretty soon but right now we are actually going to be working with penny and polly for the pony championship race and yes i am very aware before you guys start freaking out that autumn promise is very unhappy right now her mood is just the worst i am so sorry autumn promise it has definitely been a very very busy week so hopefully we'll be able to take autumn promise over either go see the vet i do have uh -huh, but i'm starting to run low on star coins we do have some star coins but at the very least i want to take good care of autumn promise and see how she and the other horses are going to be doing um and hmm we'll see if we can get her leveled up a little bit more today but let's go ahead and continue on with the next quest from penny all right penny i'm here with my pony penny polly my pony <laughs> the pony championships i feel like i need another p name somewhere in here oh peapod peapod would be a really cute animal if we had like an animal i could put in the saddlebag and call it peapod that would just like seal the deal but for now let's go see what penny wants Saga, this is a disaster. All the obstacles are broken except for one. How could this happen? I know, it was James. First, he was completely against our competition. Then he was suddenly completely nice about it. He's behind this. I know it. Saga, what should we do? Can you go speak with James about this? Thank you. Oh, I really hope that you can help us with this. Otherwise, we'll need to cancel our plans to have a pony competition. All right, just hang in there, Penny. Sad ponies don't make anyone happy, and I agree, and Autumn Promise is sad right now too, and I feel really bad about that. So let's go ahead and ride her back over to um, Fort Pinta, and we'll take care of what, her the way we can today. Oh, there's no vet in Fort Pinta either. I'm sorry, Autumn Promise. I'm really sorry about that. Ah, Autumn Promise, I'm sorry. I just ran you into a sign. And then let's ride up here, and we'll go talk to James. Like. I don't know about this, you guys. James has often caused a lot of issues, and I would say he's been a bit of a troublemaker in the past. But doing something like stealing from these ponies... Whoa, sorry about that. Didn't mean to open that up. But doing something like stealing from the ponies or like giving them shoddy goods that fall apart, that's just really, really low. I just think that that's, that's striking a lower blow than even James normally goes for. So hopefully this is just a big misunderstanding and we can go over and find out that he's not actually being that much of a jerk. And we'll be able to uh, also see something new. I just remembered. Today's Star Stable update means that the buckets have now changed. And you guys are probably a little confused what I mean by that. But there's been a new shadow update and I'm not sure if we have the shadows on right now. I might need to turn shadows on. Is that like a thing I can do? And maybe options somewhere, graphics, uh, shading. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that happened. Wow, what do you guys think? What do you think about that? Look at the shadows. Autumn Promise! Whoa! Um, what do you guys think? I, I thought we would have shadows just like immediately on, but we didn't. I'm kind of stunned. I don't know. Oh, and Autumn Promise, she looks... Is she... Does she have her little... Does she have her little head down and her eyes closed because she's so sad? Oh, no. Don't break my heart like that, Autumn Promise. Hang on. All right. And the other thing that changed is that the buckets are now different. So you can now have 12 uh, water pieces in your bucket instead of just three. So that's really interesting, um, which I guess some people were having an issue with it. But please tell me that poor Autumn Promise here isn't actually suffering because she's in a bad mood. Do, if they really start drooping their heads and closing their eyes when they're in a bad mood, I will have to pay for stable care. I try to save my star coins, but I will have to pay for stable care. You are, you are just kidding me. This is unacceptable. I can't, I can't accept this. This is too much. Lift your head, my dear. Are you feeling a little better? Is it just a pony thing? I can't tell. Is she tired? Is she just snoozy? Or does she really like lower her head when and feel feel badly when um, we have shadows? Oh my gosh! Or when we have shadows, when I when she's in a bad mood, I mean, I'm so distracted by the shadows. They have really stunned me. What do you guys think? Do you like them? 
it makes everything seem a little bit darker to me, but not in a bad way. Just like, whoa, 3D. That's how it feels. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm gonna have to see what I think about this and get used to it. James, look, James, I see your shadow. What do you have to say for about these uh, sad ponies, by the way, James? Ouch. Hello, Saga. I don't really have time to chat right now. My stomach hurts. Is it important? Okay, then. Ugh. Broken jumps? No, I don't know anything about that. Do I swear? Nah, maybe a little bit. Okay, okay, it was me that did it. <gasps> James! I should just chuck you right off this, this balcony into the water, sir. I didn't really mean to do it. Oh, oh, that- what? Oh, I'm not pleased about this. I'm not pleased about being ignored like this, James. He looks so 3D. I don't know what I think. Let's see what it looks like without the shadows again. Hmm. It's so hard to- I can't really decide. I kind of like it without shadows, but I can't decide. I think that they have their, their moments. I think I like the bright, colorful uh, look without shadows, but today we'll play with shadows and we'll just see how it goes. I, I think I could see different different looks for different days, like depending on what I was doing or if I wanted to be photogenic or <laughs> any of the other stuff that I might be working on. So I can't believe that we've just been completely ignored by James and now I have to wait on him for that. Uh, Eddie is nearby, Josh, Marley still has something for us to do, Elizabeth has something for us to do, Andy has something for us to do. Hmm, I think we might need to switch back over to Rose Stone, actually. The pony competition is definitely going to be taking us a little while. But at the same time, is there somewhere that we could maybe spend the night here? Is that an option? Uh, yeah, there's somewhere we could spend the night here. I guess would we talk to James about that. I guess we could go ahead and ask him to spend the night. That might be worth it. I want to get this pony competition thing worked out and I want to take good care of Autumn Promise. So let's see about this. Uh, stay the night at Fort Pinta. Hey Saga, both you and your horse look a little tired. If you would like, you can spend the night in exchange for a few star coins. Pretty nice option if you're waiting for something to happen. Yeah, I'm waiting for you to, to hoof it, sir. So we're going to go ahead and spend the night because I am not willing to, to rest on this pony competition any longer. It has been ignored for months. We're going to do this. Plus, I want to see what Autumn Promise thinks about everything. Hello, Autumn Promise. I wish I could make you feel better right now. I wish I could send her to Pony Island. <laughs> I don't. This isn't my home stable, or else I probably would just send her to Pony Island. Oh, I feel so bad. I'm gonna have to set up stable hand care, especially because I'm going on vacation soon. James, now nothing can stop us. James, that sounds oddly ominous. I don't think I like that. Hello, Saga. I've just ordered new fences and signs for Penny and Polly's pony competition. You can apologize to them for me. I really didn't mean to push the box of their things off the cliff so everything would break. I really didn't know what would happen. I just kind of tripped and pushed the box several meters to the edge. <gasps> James, I'm going to push you off the edge. Then I stumbled again and gave it a really hard push and it went over the edge. Really bad luck, right? But now I've ordered new equipment. It cost me a bit of money, but it'll be worth it. My stomach is feeling better already. Strange, right? Ah, oh, guilt. I think the two thing you think the two things are related? It was my bad conscience that made my stomach hurt? Ha, <laughs> you're funny, Saga. Hmm, you know, maybe this pony competition isn't such a bad idea after all. The smart part is I get to let Polly and Penny Penny and Polly try to finish it so I can learn from any mistakes they make. Later I can start an even better, better pony competition here in Fort Pinta. Brilliant! Ouch, now I have that pain in my stomach back again. Ouch, I don't know what my stomach is doing this to me. Ow! Bye, Saga. Ow, ow, ow. Poor me. <laughs> James. I hope you learn a lesson at some point, sir. All right, so let's go ahead and leave him be. Wow, I don't know what to think. Like, I really like all the work. It does, it does look nice. It does make it look much more serious, but it definitely is something different. Oh my goodness, all the horses have shadows now, and it's really... The thing is, I'm so busy looking at my own shadow. I might run into this bus if I'm not careful, because <laughs> it's so enchanting. Isn't that gorgeous? Okay, I have to say watching... Yeah, watching the shadow as we run across the ground. That's beautiful. I could get pretty addicted to that. All right, let's run up here, and then we'll go ahead... I'm so sorry, Autumn Promise, I'm going to jump. She's doing pretty well for a level 2 pony who is just level 2. So she's basically just like a brand new trained baby, just broken in. Oh, look, and you can see the apple orchard over at Fir Grove. Oh, that's so pretty. 
But she's doing very well for a poor pony that I've really pushed through quite a bit. All right, let's go see what Polly and Penny think about this. I think it was worth the star coins to go ahead and spend the night because I do want to see this quest finished. We have got a lot of things we need to do. And let's ride this way. And weave between everything. There they are. And I feel really bad that I've made Polly and Penny wait for months while we were running all over Jorvik doing so many other things. So it'll be nice to wrap this up. All right, hopefully this is the right stuff. Penny, how are you doing? Hello, Saga. This is fantastic. We received new obstacles from James, and he helped us to put them up. That was very kind of him. Maybe he isn't as awful as we thought? <laughs> well, let's just say everybody has a chance to redeem themselves, it seems. There, Saga. Now it's all set. All the fences are in place, so now we just need to ride the course from start to finish. Only ponies allowed in this race, but that's pretty clear, right? Good luck. Don't worry, don't worry. They don't mean you, Tiger Lily. You can come along as well. All right, let's go ahead and do the race. You ready, Alna Promise? <gasps> I'm going to try so hard not to get distracted. Oh, the cute little music is back. I'm going to try not to get distracted by her shadow, but it is truly beautiful to be able to see the shadow. There we go. Across the ground. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, is this gonna work this time? <gasps> it worked! Yay, Autumn Promise! We'll be able to do this. All right, up the cliff we go. Nice slow pace, but that's okay. All right, and then through here. Not bad. They made it, they made it nice and simple, but again, I think it's because I've left these poor people alone for months. All right, and up we go. Good job, Autumn Promise. She does really good at racing, actually, and I'm not even wearing my racing gear. We're just wearing like our, our cool looking autumn -y gear. All right, and up we go. Are we almost there? It always amazes me to see how the whole track is laid out, but I never really notice because we're always racing through it at different angles. whoops a dips okay. Just right there, okay. Why is this so cheerful? Oh, this is the most cheerful music ever. I swear. This is the best race. Yay! We did it this time. Good job, Autumn Promise. Hopefully this will help you level up. All right. I'm best of the month. Wow. Nobody has been here all month except me. If you keep this placement, you will get a reward in the mail at the end of the month. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm the only one that's raced here. Oh, that alone. I might make Autumn promise like the, the mistress of the, the race here and just like win it again and again and again. She'll be the queen of the race. What do you get, you guys, if you are in the top tier for the races? I would love to learn. Beautifully ridden, Saga. You really are an amazing rider. You can come back anytime you like and try our race again. I would love to, Polly. Yes, I want to do it again. Let's do it again for Autumn Promise's sake because I feel like we've put her through a lot. And then if that was it, and it was just like unlocking this, and I think it's hilarious, best of the month. Well, I guess this isn't the most popular race, but I have the oddest urge to come back again and again with Autumn Promise <laughs> and just let her take like top, top category in it. Cause that's just amazing. Up we go. But what do you win when you win these races? Huh? I don't know. I don't know. I was supposed to get something in the mail, but to be honest, I haven't checked my mail in months. <laughs> Because it's just been one thing after another and we've been so busy. All right, I'm going to go ahead and ride through here. And I do mean to do that in the training videos, but man, you guys, am I ever busy. Also, I need to let you amazing Star Stable people know I will actually be traveling next week. So I will be gone all of next week, uh, which I didn't anticipate when I agreed to, to going to visit with Chips' family. I didn't anticipate it would be that long and that I would be away from my recording for that long. But I'm going to go ahead and we are going to do some extra adventures this week so you'll have some stuff next week too. Just don't freak out if the new Mustang isn't immediately in the video. I have to admit that I'm not often tempted by the new horses. Like right out of the gate, I'm not often tempted to be like, yes, take my star coins. But this new Mustang that's going to be coming out looks pretty amazing. But the week after that, the day after I get home, we will actually be having 
dun dun dun! Yay! Even better score! But they will actually be having the My Stable release. So, so the My Stable update is on its way, you guys, and it will be coming out on the 30th. So that's a pretty big deal. And we're going to be having a really good time seeing what the My Stable update has and seeing the new Mustang. But for now, we're enjoying our time with our beautiful pony. I think I want to at least level her up to level three, too. So let's see. What can we do now? We have, oh, Conrad. Conrad has a new mission for us. What's that? Interesting, and it looks like Tan might have something new. And Miss Holdsworth, <gasps> there's a lot going on over at Moreland Stables. All right, let's go over to Steve's farm. And then let's go see what's happening over at Moreland today. So Steve, good to see you as always. And we'll have to come back tomorrow and see if we can do anything fun with Steve and Rose Stone. Yeah, I, I think the shadows are pretty amazing. They definitely make things feel more official. Like it suddenly feels really, uh, how do I, not like mature, but in the way of not being just cutesy anymore. It's really hard to explain. I didn't know that shadows could have such an effect even though I'm from an artist family. So what do you guys think about them? I'm pretty curious. Do I still have a shadow? Yeah, I do. Wow, this is a cool thing. The whole world feels more dynamic. Like I could reach out and touch things a little easier. All right, so let's ride over here and let's see what's happening. Tan apparently has something to say. Lost. Oh, yeah, she lost the money. That's right. Well, we'll definitely be talking to her about that in just a second. But let's come over. It seems that Josh has something to say, too. So let's see what Josh has to say. Let's unlike him to have, uh, have a new quest. Let's see. Get first prize without even winning. What? Hey, Saga. So glad you're here. I could really use your help right now. What happened? So someone stole my trophies. Oh, they're gone. Every last one of them. All the prizes I won from all my competitions. Gone. You want to tell? You want me to tell you from the beginning? Okay, but there's not much to tell. When I got here this morning, everything was just like normal. So I set up the pole racing. Uh, so I set up the pole bending race as normal. Cleaned up a bit and got a cup of coffee whilst I waited for the competition crazy riders to show up. I had a little bit of spare time, so I thought I'd get some stuff done in my wagon. You know, organize some stuff a little. And it was then I noticed that everything was not as it should be. I keep all my things in that wagon, and someone had been in and trashed it all up. Worse still, it was only when I tidied up that I noticed all my trophies were gone. The thief must have totally gotten away by this point, so I have no idea who could have done it. The only thing I know is that he or she must have been here during the night, as I checked the wagon out before I left yesterday evening, and everything looked fine. If I've seen any other clues? Nah, but then I haven't looked around that closely. Wait, what's that on the ground? Some kind of footprint in the sand. Maybe it's a clue, Saga. You'll, fi you'll follow the trail of footprints? Okay, good luck, Saga. Hope you find the thief. All right, so we'll have to go ahead and do that. Not at the moment, though, because you know who we need in order to solve this mystery. We definitely need to bring our wonderful, wonderful horse, Silver Secret, in on this. Because he, as our Lizzie, he is the one who is very, very curious about what happens with these kinds of mysteries. So I think that Silver Secret would actually be the best horse to ride for that. And let's go ahead and talk to Tan really quickly. And we're going to go around the racetrack today. Dun dun dun! Tiger Lily hang in there! Oh, she flipped her little ears back. <laughs> I think that she's okay with the pace of Autumn Promise though. Autumn Promise doesn't exactly go at the most breakneck pace. We don't even have background music this time for our race. That's how quickly she goes. So, alright, we'll ride Autumn Promise through, and you guys, I think we've got a mystery here at Silver, or at the uh, Moreland Stables that we need to solve. And a mystery is exactly what Silver Secret loves the most. So I think we'll go ahead and get him out of the stable and bring him over to Moreland. I have a good feeling I know who we're probably going to run into here. Uh, when it comes to something missing, <laughs> when it comes to wallets missing and shiny trophies missing, pretty sure I, I've got a good idea of who's going to be suddenly mysteriously visiting Moreland. Alright, let's ride through and we'll have to see if we can- it's so weird to be running a race with no music. <laughs> and we'll see if Silver Secret can help us get to the mystery there. Alright, let's ride through and there we go. Bobcat girls, nice and slow, but that's okay because guess what? Now our beautiful Autumn Promise, who looks gorgeous, actually. The horses look amazing with the shadows, to be honest. And 
dun 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 she's now level three there you go autumn promise so i'm pretty excited for her and we'll have to check in on our mail if we really end up being the only ones to ever go on that race this month and so we're the ones who win it for some reason but next time we will go grab silver secret and we'll pop over here and start getting to the bottom of the mystery that's happening and then hopefully rose stone will have a little bit of time to help us out when it comes to the area over here when it comes to Yarlheim and its quest and we might even get out amethyst mist so she can help out with elizabeth sunbeam and all of those flowers because she likes anything to do with magic so it's really fun a lot of you guys have been requesting that we rotate our horses more often so hopefully this will be a great way to do it just kind of theming it on what we have planned for the day but i'm really excited to have our little pony and actually now that i think about it she really is little because we can actually come up to her <laughs> she's so tiny i never thought to get off her and like actually compare with my height and her height before but it's adorable and let me know what you guys think about all of these beautiful shadows and i'll see you next time Bye bye